Hello everyone, how are you? It's good to see you again. So it's Christmas in the cathedral and here's the donkey. And this is the donkey that belonged to Mary and Joseph and which carried them all the way to Bethlehem. Do you remember how Mary had to sit on the donkey for the long journey, even though she was just going to soon have a baby? And when they got to Bethlehem, they knocked on all the doors, but there was no room for them anywhere. They found somewhere to sleep, and they settled in the area where the animals sleep. And Mary had the baby Jesus, and they put the baby Jesus in the food trough, in the manger, because there was nowhere else for him to go to sleep. And outside on the hills, the shepherds were fast asleep. And suddenly they were woken up by an angel. The angel said, don't be scared. Because sometimes angels can be a bit frightening if they come when you're asleep. And the angel told them that a baby had been born. And the baby was very, very special. And that they could find the baby in the manger in Bethlehem. And the shepherds were so excited that they all got up and they ran down the hill to find the baby and have a good look at the special baby. And a long way away in the east, the wise men knew that something special had happened because they saw a new star in the sky. And they knew that that star meant a special king would be born. So they packed up and they started traveling from the east all the way to find the baby following the star. And they brought presents with them, gold, frankincense and myrrh, to give to the baby Jesus. And they found Jesus with Mary, his mother, and they worshipped him and they gave him the special presents. And that's really important because that's why we get presents at Christmas and why we give other people presents. I hope you're having a good day. I hope you get lots of lovely presents and I hope the people you've got presents for like what you've given, you give them. And I hope you have a really special Christmas. And if we don't see you this year, we're still thinking about you and we're praying for you and we hope that you'll stay well and we'll see you soon. Bye.